Hey guys, what is up? Delonix here. So I'm going to be bringing you guys today a tutorial. This is kind of um kind of different. Usually I do survival and stuff, but um because of 1.7.9, I was trying to look up like like awesome ways to find diamonds, most efficient strip mines to find diamonds. And so um just to prove to you guys I'm not using a seed or anything here. Here it is. I'll load the world up and I will show you the best way that I um can find diamonds. I'm doing this in creative mode because uh it's gonna save a lot of time. As soon as the world loads. What the hell? Okay, there we go. So uh I don't recommend digging straight down, but that's exactly what I'm gonna do because uh just for time's sake, I'm not gonna build a staircase all the way down. And I usually like to go down to level ten. And then I'd clear out an area like, whoa, that leg. Wow, I'm getting weird leg spikes. Wow, hold on. Video settings. I could probably turn this down a bit. I probably don't need it to be that. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. I don't know why it was so large. Um, alright. So just clear an area out like this. It doesn't have to be this tall or anything, but as long as you're just standing on level 10... It's a lot organized when it's a lot bigger area, though. So. Now what you need to do is from right here. Yo, there's some iron. You will have to go and usually I'll start, like, right here. And I'll check the coordinates right here. Or actually, I'll just do this so that I'll go all the way to 340. So just dig straight this way till 340. Um, actually, I'm going to get some torches. Just so I can light this up so you guys can see. And uh, so there we, there we go. We got some redstone and iron already. So you can mine that stuff out. It's fine. Uh, just continue going a bit. Getting close to the end of the line. I don't think you'll find diamonds on your very first run all the way down, but uh, there's some lapis. You'll usually find a lot of um, tools at your res resources. So I'm going to fly all the way down. And now what I like to do is I'll just use a slab just to make it look kind of better. But I'll put a slab here and then I'll do one right here. So, when you're right here, when you're digging, the only thing you miss is this block. And this block. So now, when I'm right here, I'll dig out all the way to 310 again. Here, I'll light this up. So now I can actually view what this block is, where I couldn't in this mine. And I get to view what this block was, which I couldn't in this side and everything else I can view. So this whole, here I'll use wool. So blue wool is what I can see on the layers of right now. So with just this, I can see this whole area. Because this has got this. So I'll dig this out all the way down to 310. And you might run into like a cave like that where it was recently dug from like where I got the redstone. There's more redstone there. So I'll come all the way down, and, wow, there's more redstone. So much redstone. I found, like, everything, every ore except gold and diamonds. So just continue going, and I believe it was right around right here where I stopped. So, now, if I fly all the way back, you can already see we've got a bunch of iron, even some lapis. And uh, just to clarify, you can probably see up there that I'm using 1.7.9. So now out of that, what I couldn't see was this block right here. But that was the only thing out of this that I couldn't see. And of course, these blocks right here. So now 
I'll come back to doing um, right here and now this changes here so I can see that and I can see this and this and that so there's really nothing that I've missed out of all of these so it is the most efficient way so that you don't miss any single uh, singular pieces of diamond or something for say and uh, I'm just gonna continue going until it usually doesn't take me this long usually on a map I find probably like six out of six tunnels maybe so I recommend you collect a bunch of iron before doing this because this is the greatest way that I've found diamonds but it's also a really great way to find iron we usually want to have iron while you go into this so right here is 310 so then we'll fly all the way back you don't need to stop at 100 you can continue going it's honestly just like a personal preference so now I could view all this but I couldn't view here or here or here or here so now what we'll do is do this and now you can view all of this so it just continues going like this pretty much and um, there's really no way that you're gonna miss any uh, pieces of um, gold or because I know sometimes diamonds spawn in like ones iron sometimes even spawns in ones gold spawns in ones so now there's no way of even missing any of that and this does take a bit of time so uh, it might take like a few minutes to find some diamonds but I mean diamonds are the most rare thing in the game and this is the greatest way that I know of for getting diamonds so I'll probably just time lapse it and then I'll tell you how long exactly it took me to find these diamonds well as you can see I ran into a cave that was at the level of uh, the level of gold and diamonds and stuff and we did indeed find some gold and we found two veins of gold and if I found this in UHC I'd probably be crapping my pants because that's insanely awesome and um, so I guess this also helps you find caves I've never really used it to find caves but I guess that's one way you could find caves also if I do run into a cave I will just um, I usually just take a look and I'll spelunk the cave and whoa I think I want to try this actually and if I don't find anything um, like I, I just clear the cave out that's when I'll just just go back like block it off and um, so like this say I would have cleared this cave out and then I would literally get everything in this cave and then I just head back and I'd notice like it goes this far back so I might probably just end it there and I'd continue going this way so here we found gold through using this method so uh... still no diamonds and this has honestly been the longest it's taken me to actually find diamonds through this kind of method so uh... I might end up moving to a new location but usually what I do is just continue expanding that way and I don't know why I did that holy so I actually broke this one right here but we found diamonds just like this so we'll see how many there was here there was two three four five six so six diamonds and what was the weirdest part about this whole thing is that holy crap my dog is going crazy I'm so sorry so the weirdest part about this whole thing is that we literally dug a hundred blocks this whole section and found that many diamonds so I don't know if like I was at the wrong level like I don't think I was I've used this level and it goes it shows level 12 right here and 13 right there so like I, this is like the best level I've used because we didn't miss any blocks and I know that for sure so we legitimately it would have been we would have found the exact same amount of diamonds if we just dug this whole area out so I guess I was just unlucky today but there you go I found diamonds so that took longer than expected but 
sometimes that's just what it is. What I recommend is that if it goes to a part like where you've dug out over like tons of tunnels and you can't find anything, just do this and I recommend doing this. Just go and dig a tunnel this way for a bit. And then um probably like uh wouldn't say how oh, okay. I wouldn't say a hundred blocks but maybe like seventy and then just do the exact same thing and dig out a little area and then just continue making the tunnels because obviously that was like a dead section. But that was honestly really weird and crazy. I can't believe it took me that long. But that is my most efficient way for finding diamonds. I guess it doesn't really show in this video, but I've used it in like Project Lucrum and uh, Longbow servers and stuff. So I uh, think you should check it out. And um, if you like this method, please like and subscribe. Man, I've never actually asked that, I don't think. Oh, I feel thirsty now, but, um, if you enjoy the video, like it. If you don't, I don't even care. Okay, so, thanks. Bye.